Okay, today is uh, field day for homeschool kids. <laughs> and uh, today we're gonna go learn about physics, hand-eye coordination, and all that good junk. It's called going to the firing range. And today we're going to learn some dignitary protection tactics, escape and, escape and invasion tactics, and um, also physical education. It pays to be homeschooled. <laughs> it pays to be homeschooled. So we're going to go to the firing range uh, about 10 minutes here from the house. And uh, we're going to go through some uh, little scenarios here and show you guys. Uh, maybe pass on a little bit of knowledge what I know. You folks out there, maybe save your life one day. So uh, we'll be back with you guys in just a few. Go. Okay, that was uh, a little more aggressive, a little aggressive thing I just did to get it started. But uh, next we're going to do a, uh, an escape, an evasion, uh, slash dignitary protection, basic technique, where the person you are rescuing has to hold on to you and works in all scenarios even even in uh, pitch black conditions so listen for my keywords my daughter she's going to be the uh the victim that i'm rescuing and watch how she uh listens to everything that i tell her and that is what is going to keep her alive hopefully also during the process, if I take lead and I am mortally wounded, I'll immediately hand my weapon to the escaping victim, grab my secondary weapon, uh, lay down a covering fire while the victim escapes with my battle rifle. Okay, here we go. Pay real close attention to when I holler out, I'm hit. Pay close attention to the transition and how I lay down a covering fire. Also, pay close attention to how my body is a shield for the, uh, the victim that I am rescuing. Okay, here we go. We're hot. Ready? Okay. Here we go.
Okay, the next scenario is you got something has happened. The uh, fertilizer has hit the spreader and you've got a family member who can't deal with it and is going crazy. It's got tunnel vision. Cannot take orders. But you know you've got to get that person out by force now. Uh, these peripoles sometimes will fight you even though you are best friends with them. Could be even a wife, child of yours. May even fight you in a scenario where you've got to get out and you've got to fire back and you're taking fire. These kind of events people have a hard time overcoming mentally. It's an entire mental game. What you have to understand is them. Have compassion on their inability to deal with the situation at hand. You take responsibility. You take control. You grab that person and you drag that person if you've got to out of that situation by force. Even if you've got to hurt them. Okay, well, I'm not going to hurt my daughter in this situation. But if you've got to slap someone real hard in the face to help bring them around, to save their life, and to keep their uh, ignorance of the situation from killing you also, then by all means, slap the heck out of them. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, I've got my person. I've got my person. Okay, Alicia loves the AK. She always begs to go shoot it. And uh, since today is uh, school field trip day for homeschool kids, uh, she's going to learn about uh, anger management, conflict resolution, <laughs> and uh, mechanics, okay? <laughs> physics <laughs> so uh, a safe firearm is a safe firearm she does have the safety off but there's no round in the chamber and she is going to be shooting way up there at that green yellowish looking thing at the bottom of that stone <laughs> so she may take a few well aimed shots but I have a feeling she's going to make my barrel red hot because <laughs> she likes to make it rock rock adult contemporary adult contemporary okay all right chamber around you got a round chambered? Chamber around. Hold on. Oh, come on, Lisa. Chamber around. That's what I thought. There you the go. Oh, it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? What happened in there? Hold it. Hold it. Very stiff. You got to, you can't pull the AK back and then let it go forward you pull it all the way back and just let go like a rubber band all right it has to smack it in all right go Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
You want another magazine? All right, another magazine. Another magazine right here. So. Now those are those steely magazines. Remember uh -huh. you gotta put it in, uh-uh. Put it in like that and rock it in. Just like that. Just like that. Okay, I want a different target. You want a different target? Yeah. Don't shoot at rocks. Okay. Um, yeah, we don't want rocks. There's today. paper target right at the base of that tree. Where? Uh, right there. Where? See that piece of cardboard sitting right below? That tree right there? Yep. Shoot at that right there. There you go. That's the sound of freedom right there, baby! Woo! Woo! <laughs> See? This girl's got my back. If I gotta hand off my weapon, that girl knows how to shoot, okay? She ain't afraid, man. She can shoot. So. Oh, I love this gun. I think we might be about done here. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to spend ammo. too much more of my ammo. Golly, man. So. Shalom. Shalom. Uh, Zahal. Zahal means stand and fight. Zahal means stand and fight.